Hey guys, and welcome to episode 20. Yay. Um, so I need to run over here. I'm actually running out of leather for enchantments or enchanting books. So it is time to... Let's see how many levels I got. Earlier it was 640. Oh. And we have 647 levels in here right now. And I've only got one book left. So... Um, I'm going to have to work on my reed farm after this, but um, I'm going to go ahead and... Oh, i got to go get some materials. I'll be right back. All right, I just had to make some um, stone bricks because I forgot about that. So, let me fly over here. I'm going to enclose the top of this, and I'm going to put my, my cow shard right there. Um... I'm hoping that when the water comes in and pushes that it will go around here so I might have to do something different but we'll see here in a minute so once uh, this rain quits lagging me out then I can uh, kind of finish this and see what we get Oop, that ain't gonna work this so I'll be right back once I finish the roof here Alright, so I finished the top and I made my cage. So now I just need to find where I put the block. I think it was... Nope, I was off one. So let's drop down. Let's, uh... Let's see. That right there. Jetpacks drive me crazy. Okay, so let's uh, let's just not be able to put it down. That's right. Er. So now oh, that's too far. So we'll, we'll run the cable here and just come right down here and ta-da. Alright, um, I think mobs will spawn on that so I'm just gonna put another half slab and then torch it just to just to keep uh, keep that safe so um, Let's, uh, oh, I should have put a torch up there. Err, I don't have cobblestone, really? Okay, so let me, I'll make a switch and I'll, or lever and I'll be right back. Okay, so, drop the lever right here. Let's activate it. Make sure it's on. And, doink. Put the cow in there. And, see how I want to do this, I think. If I do both water sources in this the corners and I need one block up so we'll do this That hmm, still seems okay. So we'll just do this right here. They should just get pushed right down to the water and the conveyor belts will uh, help them on in here. So we need to put down another one here. 
another one here. And let's turn the stuff off up top for a minute so we can kind of see what's going on. Oh, let's turn that uh, hover mode off here. So let's this. And there. Ooh, there's a creeper down there wanting me. Man, if I would have kept missing him and he would have blown up, I would have been ill right there. Okay, so. Alright. So that's over with, all that noise. So we're going to break this glass and. Oh, I didn't think about that. Yeah, this will work. Break this glass. We're going to put a block here. We're going to try to get off the belt. <laughs> and why can't I put the stupid thing there. Alright. Um, let's go hover mode. And try to fly up here. And see if we can... Oh. Can't put it on glass. That is why. Alright. So now. Let's get the slurge hammer. Where we, where did the sledgehammer go? Um, okay, I'll be back when I go. Let me go find the sledgehammer. Okay, so I also grabbed uh, my glass viewer so that um, I'm kind of thinking about replacing the glass. All right, what's what's going on here? Hold on, one sec. All right, I guess I hit F8 when I hit F9 to start to record. So, um, let's. First of all, put the buckets up. Let's put this stuff up. Um, I've been messing with some bees. Uh, let's put this stuff up. All right, so we got some kind of inventory now. So, <laughs> so we'll crank up the conveyor belt like this. Um, yeah, this switch is going to have to come over one. Oh, 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 oh. I didn't want to do that. Okay, well. Oh, oh, shoot. <laughs> almost uh, almost died from the uh the sword over there hmm let's uh let's just go through the roof here <laughs> that would have been uh messed up right there let's see okay oh. it must have been a half slap come on get up there let's just put a torch down here um well that was pretty cool so I guess the cows won't always get stuck back there so if one gets stuck back there it'd be fine so let's go ahead and uh, break this and put a block here let's move this over one Yeah, so we move this over one. Put 
put that there with the torch and turn this F7 off because I figured out that that's why I get that little lag. So let's drop down here and put my switch back up. Bada bean. Now, one thing I just thought of is if a mob comes up here or if a mob gets up here somehow and comes down and drops in there it's going to kill me and that will be bad so I need to do this let's uh I think I still have my diamond hacksaw on me yep I don't want to use cobble covers so I want to make Do this right here. Then we can put that there, that there, and that there. So nothing will fall in there now. Nope. Okay. So let's put the viewing glass up now so we're gonna start from here like this They shouldn't walk off of here. <laughs> doom de doom de doom. Don't mind me. I'm just a cow just coming through. Coming through. Yeah. Oh, I need this raw beef right here. Need to make a barrel for that. Um which was right here. So raw beef alright so that looks like it worked out pretty good um, I wonder if wonder if it will run on viewing glass nope I couldn't get that lucky so alright And if you put it down like that, you can take the hammer and position it. <coughs> Did it again. Man, it. Tell you what. Oh, here, I'll just. Um, that turtle would kill me before I could turn it off, probably. Yep. So let's just turn the turtle off. Terminated. So we can go ahead and uh, fix this glass while we're at it, since we're breaking stuff. All right, and I need to get in there and get that stuff. So we will just break through the wall here. Ta-da, ta-da. And... I don't know why I'm putting so much glass up there, but just in case, I guess. So here... Um, I had a spot left open, turtle blocks that, turtle blocks that, and not like that. So leave the bottom half, put this here, 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 and down there like that. 
and leave this space open to put stuff into. This should work just fine. Um, just looks a little weird, don't it? Okay, so let's turn it back on and flippy the switchy. So they look like they come out pretty quick. So if they're being too high, if another mob comes down, it can't walk over that way. The conveyor belt's just going to push them back. So I wonder if. Let's see if I can put this up here. Will they still come through? Oh, yeah. There we go. All right, so let's go ahead here and let's just go ahead and uh, fix this glass. Uh, I bet I don't have enough. What was it to create this? glass and iron yeah I should be able to have enough oh by the way here's my blaze rods the found out that the tesseract oh I can't leave that off that's powering my steam boiler oh get back oh, don't tell me oh crap oh uh, shoot how many of y'all just figured that one out so the blaze rods are powering the powering my thing um, steam boiler so I don't know why I turned that off uh, I spent too much time over there too I bet let's see what happened it's still kinda full got four here so Ain't as much damage as I thought it was going to be, but uh, let's hurry up and get back over here and turn this thing on. Why did I come up so far? Alright. And we'll just run over here. or fly over here <laughs> turn this thing on meltdown alright let's just go ahead and turn the pigman back on I'm gonna actually set this to where I can turn this on and off down here so I won't have this problem again so <clears throat> alright let's see how this goes with all this coming through now I'm almost wondering if I have to put in another melee turtle to help out, but I think it should be thinking it should be enough here. Yep, that's so. Uh, that's looking pretty good. So, what I'm going to do is I'm going to go cook uh, cook a lot of glass, and since I've got a lot of iron because of this, <laughs> I've got a thousand twenty four stacks of um, nuggets here. So I'm going to replace this ga glass with uh, viewing glass. I'm going to let the cows run for a while, and we should be getting pretty good number of leather here. So, I will be back in a few minutes. Alright, I'm back and uh, this is a big congestion here. So, don't think this is going to work out too well. Because the cows don't look like they're coming in there because of the pigmen are dropping too fast. So, it looks like I'll need to turn the pigmen off to let the cows run. So I'm going to have to set up that type of stuff. 
so let's uh let's just go up here and turn the pigment off and uh get some leather let's see how see how we catch up here <clears throat> yep there there we go so yeah it's gonna be one or the other it won't be just um just both or all so just wanted to kind of show you that um, look at that I already got 94 sweet woot okay so I will be back once I get my glass put in here so all right so there we go and as I noticed when I was doing this it didn't look like my turtle was killing anymore So I don't know what um, what type of problem we have here. So let's terminate it. And let's turn cows off. Let's reboot this again. Something seems to be messed up here. Well, I saw it attack that time. Is it not a detecting? Hmm. But I'm gonna have to move the turtles. I'm gonna probably have to put the melee turtle here and the XP turtle down there. And uh as I was saying, um when I had the Tazeract here, it was causing some kind of issues where it would not keep the uh keep the uh, steam boiler full when I'm not online so I'm just running down to check it real quick it looks like it's fully powered but yeah so I'm not sure what the deal is here so but uh, um, I'm going to figure out why my turtle is not killing the cows I might have to do something different because apparently it was working let's get a few in here and see what happens so it comes off in there yeah I mean why did it why did it stop working a minute ago so I'm gonna watch this for a while and uh, I think that's gonna be it for this uh, episode 20 and uh, next episode I should have an update on what uh, what I do here unless I change it around and uh, not sure why it stopped last time looks like it's oh there it goes so it looks like when a cow comes into the s sideways it does it but when they come in straight, they just get popped. So I may have to change this around after all. So, all right, guys. Thanks for watching.